Now, the uh, the writing process for the screenplay, mm -hmm. um, when you, you weren't the only writer in it. No. Um, how did that process work, having to work with somebody else? Well, um, is my it easier working partner. by yourself than working with somebody else? Or? Oh, no, I, I love working with Kyle. I've been working with Kyle as a partner screenwriter for, God, 15 years. Wow, okay. And it's so... Like, it's like a marriage. So, yeah. you, so you're married to your wife, oh, and then you yeah, have your no, other he, marriage. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, he uh, he will tell you we, we fight like an old married couple. Mm. Um, but no, we, we have a great dynamic. Is that I'm good at setting up a story, and he's good at writing characters. So perfect. Yeah. So basically, the story is by me, and it's really kind of just the, and then the characters' motivations and who they are. Because Kyle's also a brilliant actor, and he appears in the film as uh, Red, the dude with the beard. Okay. Um, and uh, so he's great with coming up with character motivation and uh, who they are as a person. So that comes from his world of acting. Gotcha. And then uh, after we finished up with the script and then uh, Lance was brought on board, he cleaned up the script with uh, Athena. So they, you know, she cleaned up some of the dialogue and some of the situations. And then uh, once we came to a final on it after... I think after like three or four versions, it didn't take very long until we figured out what we wanted to do with it. Because we knew, we knew from the beginning that we wanted it to be a very simple revenge story, and we didn't want the story to distract from the real story, which was basically uh, the underarching story, which is really about uh, Alan himself. Because as I said, this is a story of a man who thinks he's the hero, but he's actually the villain. Okay. And we really wanted that to be the most. Um, present element mm -hmm. of the story. 